Today I'm gonna teach you guys how to disassemble the cluster and put in the new glow gauge. So what we're gonna do first is, since I'm the cameraman and the installer, it's gonna be kind of hard. So what you wanna do first, guys, is take off these plastics. Okay, and so we can get inside and make work on the main thing. And also, what you wanna do is on top here. Remove this. Remove this bulb. So when we take it off, it doesn't interfere. Okay, since I already took part off, so we're gonna take off the top part. Save time. It just pops out, guys. Okay. There's gonna be a two of them. There's gonna be. one and there's the black one remove both of those and they have a cover thing here remove that also so when you're installing the new glow gauge you want to get some a very small razor so you guys can cut this part off. See that part right there? I mean you can cut it anywhere you want. I made a cut here. That's another one here. And I made another one here. You guys see that? That's so you can put the wires. So what you guys want to do is do not pull out the needles. Absolutely do not pull out the needles. This is my old cluster. That's why I'm using this for an example. The needle no longer works because I had followed a YouTube video on how to install these clusters and I pull out the needle. Now they don't work. So I'm going to teach you another way how to do it is without pulling the needles. And you get the single face. What you want to do is you want to slide it. Slide it, slide it, slide it. See, when you get it down to there, go under, under, okay, it pops right in. And I'm doing this with one, one hand, guys. Come on, I'm doing this with one hand. Just make, sure, just make sure you guys center, center it right. And there's this little thing right there. You guys see that? The little thing. There's a hole for it. Make sure that goes. That goes. Put that in the right spot for it. See? Pops right in. Okay. And then all you guys do is just center it. And you see where the wire is going? This is where I have my wire. See, that's what that's what the purpose of that cut is. And you're gonna need to cut it. And if you guys got double-sided sticky tape, which I already have it, <clears throat> just get the very thinnest you can, and just place them on top of these guys. You know, one here, another here, another here, just so that you know when the needles go, they could come back. You know. I'm gonna install the other piece. This would be a lot easier if I had two hands. See, I'm still doing it under. So what you want to do is put it on. You can bend these guys. You know, you can move the needles. It's fine, but just don't pull it out. So put under. So when you go very under, you push it, and then the other two guys should follow.
You see how that looks? It pops in. And then just move it. Don't forget about that double sided tape. You can move the needle so I could put this into the hole. Okay. See? Because if you don't put the double sided sticky tape, it's going to be puffy. And you want to like put that all the way down so the, the needles could move accordingly. Okay. And then for this piece. Still, I'm still doing it one hand, so one hand on the camera and one hand putting this thing together. Okay, got one in. Okay, I got one in, right? So, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna Move the needles. You see, I'm moving it. Move it upward. <laughs> so then you could get under it. See how I got that under? And then just work your magic. Just make sure it's in completely, guys. Got everything in, and your gas. This, these guys, you guys can move around. You know, the easiest thing to do is fill up your tank, or if your gas is empty, leave it on E. So, if you guys are moving around, just put it back where it belongs. This one, you just wanna. It's gonna go down automatic because my car is not on, as you can tell. Let's see, it's gonna go down. Once you start, then you just put it all the way down. Okay. And remember these things I was talking about? What you wanna do is you wanna run your wire. You wanna run your wire down there. Otherwise, you cannot close your cluster. So run the wire down there. Okay, guys. So I got one here. Just, you know, make sure if you guys are doing the hole, just make sure. You guys can do it anywhere you want. I mean, the plastic part is pretty easy to cut. Just get a sharp knife or a razor blade. Okay. So then you put the face plate in. Alright, that's easy, right? And for these two bulbs, this one right here, this guy, take out the bulbs. Took them off. If you leave them on, you're gonna get lighting through here and here, and the, the gauges are not gonna look nice. And then you're gonna have to take it apart again and then take out these bolts again. So, and uh, just do it ahead of time so you save you guys and save yourself some time. Okay, let's put that back on. Just make sure your wires. Okay. Just make sure they're they're good. Then you just snap it down. Snap it down into place. wire back, put this thing back. Okay. Remember guys, don't pull out the goddamn needle, you do, 
You're gonna have to buy yourself a new one. Alright, thanks.